event this week on the reality of wrestling. It is Diamond's Division Action, and it is a special four Diamond Gauntlet match. And we're seeing the queen of House Rose, Rachel Rose, making her walk to the ring. And this is somebody who, although her attitude is less than desirable, oh, well, there we go, that's actually a nice sign from her. Slap and five with a fan. Although, though, her attitude is less than desirable, her in-ring aptitude is way through the roof. She has really come a long way since making her debut in Reality of Wrestling. She gets better and better and better every time we see her. And now she has a shot to be a champion. These gauntlet contests, you never want to find yourself out first or second. And speaking of second, here she comes right now, the second entrant into this gauntlet match. The big tree, Alex Grassi. You most recently saw Alex Grassi on AEW Dark, making her AEW debut. Hopefully we will see more of her over on that program and still see plenty of her on the reality of wrestling from San Antonio, Texas. Here are the first two competitors. Remember, folks, in a gauntlet match, once you beat your opponent. So, for instance, if Alex Gracia were to beat Rachel Rose or vice versa, they stay in the match. The next entrant comes in, and so on and so forth, until we have one woman left standing. And the key here is you don't want to take all the damage in the world. You want to take as little damage as possible. So try to get a quick win to remain fresh for the rest of of your opponents and that has to be in the strategy of our strategy book of both Rachel Rose and Alex Gracia here tonight nice waist lock there from Alex Gracia a little amateur wrestling Rachel Rose reverses it oh and look at that Goodrich suplex cover one kick out after one Alex Gracia has been there before she has risen to the top of the Reality Wrestling Diamonds division. She has won that championship. Rachel Rose, a title has eluded her thus far in her wrestling career at the row. Will that change this evening? Or how will the fatigue be a factor for both of these women? Can one of them run the table and go all the way to the end to win that championship? You see both of them using tactics that are going to slow their opponent down without also exerting the most energy in the world. There's a submission hold there from Rachel Rose. It's She couldn't get the fingers locked, but it looked pretty good there for a second. Now front face lock. Rachel Rose in the pink dream going at it. to the pink dream. Pink dream gets the ropes, ducks the big boot from Rachel Rose. Rachel Rose reversal. Can she get the backslide? Rachel Rose using, using those longer legs to her advantage with that leverage and look at that. Speaking of, smell. The Roses, oh man, I thought she would have had it right there. We've seen her win a match like that before. Beautifully executed from the Queen of House Rose. Rachel Rose pulling 
on those hips of Alex Gracia. Trying to get her to let go of the rope, she does. Wait a minute, roll through, cover, one, two, and did she get it? She did. Alex Gracia gets the three count on Rachel Rose. Rachel Rose has been eliminated from the gauntlet, but how much energy did Alex Gracia have to exert to move on to face her next opponent? And here's the thing you all, oh, and here she comes. We want to talk about somebody who's got all the tools. Promise Braxton sliding to the ring, about to take it to Alex Gracia. And we'll see how much Alex Gracia has left in the tank after battling Rachel Rose for several minutes in the opening moments of this match. And look at that, some clubbing forearms to the back. Oh my goodness, and a right hand. Promise Braxton, just impressive every time we've seen her. She's impressive. Cover here. One, two. And Promise Braxton's strategy has to be the same as everyone else's in this match. Quick wins, quick wins. And you already have an opponent who's been out there for several minutes. You know that she's weaker. You know that she's used more energy than you. She's exerted all of that physical exhaustion. Swing and a miss. Alex Grossi. Oh, and another one. Reversal into the corner. Promise Braxton laying on that apron. Oh, wow, and a big right forearm from Alex Grossi, the pink dream, knocking Promise Braxton back. And now Promise, oh! Return of the favor, sending Alex Gracia's face right in that top turnbuckle. Referee starting his count. Oh, and a missile drop kick. Catching Alex Gracia a little low. Cover one, two, and a kick at a two and a half. Alex Gracia, got to give her credit. Braxton wearing down Alex Gracia. Very smart move here. She's at one moment gaining her own breath, resting a little bit while she's taking out the oxygen needed to get to the muscles, get to the body of Alex Gracia. Oh! <clears throat> Gracia against the ropes. Duxy looking for that backslide. Can she get it? Didn't work against Rachel. It didn't work against Promise. Promise, oh, and a drop kick there from Alex Gracia. That might have been the end that she needed. Alex Gracia rolls through, looking for that head scissor, gets her over. And there's that 619. Alex Gracia close to finishing this one off. Oh, and a somersault. Cover, one, two, and a reversal, one, two. Oh man, has she got it. Promise Braxton, in similar fashion to how Rachel Rose was defeated, just defeated Alex Gracia, and now she is one win away for the Diamonds Championship. But that goes through Roxy, the youngest champion in the history of this company. Roxy rolled through cover, one, two. Roxy said, I'm not gonna, I don't get paid by the minute, I'm not gonna waste my time. Backslide, cover, one, two. Braxton kicking out again. Oh, beautiful spinning heel kick from Roxy, another cover, one, two. Roxy's had the champion's advantage in more ways than one this evening. Not having to come out first. Being able to be the last woman in, and you are the freshest woman out there. At 18 years of age, Roxy continues to impress. She is just a few mere weeks away from being the longest reigning Diamonds champion in history. Perhaps she'll hold it to her 19th birthday. 
We will have to see. Oh, knees to the back, rolls up. One, two. Beautiful, innovative offense there from the Prodigy. Thomas Braxton double hooks the legs. A real deep cover there. Still not enough to get the job done. Look at that. The boot just being thrust into the throat of Rock C. in this match. She didn't spend the longest time defeating Alex Gracia, so she still has most of her juice left in the tank. Snapmare, kick to the bottom of the spine, right above the hips. That one has to hurt. And now the knee right in the middle of the back, pulling back on the labrum on the shoulders of Roxy extending the arms in a way that they're not meant to extend. And you see the pain on the young champion's face. Can she turn this around? Look there, Roxy. Beautiful submission hold. Got her in a front face lock. Has her legs wrapped around her body, the ribs of Promise Braxton, making it oh so very difficult to breathe. Isaac Bouillon, very close checking in on this. And it looks like Promise Braxton is fading. Somehow back up to a vertical base though. Oh, it's sitting Rock C right into that top turnbuckle. That was the desperation move that Promise Braxton needed. Backbreaker by Promise Braxton out of nowhere. Cover one, two. She almost did it. The championship was in her grasp. Roxy hanging on. Which one of these two women will walk into swing boat as the reality of wrestling Diamonds champion? Promise Braxton, those double underhooks. What's she going for there? Trying to get Roxy up, Roxy not letting her. Oh, beautiful. And look at the face of Roxy. He's pissed, oh, and that insecurity. That's gonna win the match if she can get capitalized to it. Gets her over cover. One, two, and two and a half. And Roxy, Roxy in disbelief, as is our studio audience here at Reality of Wrestling. That normally does the trick. That normally gets the job done. Oh! Roxy with that education cover. One, two, three. Roxy remains your reality of wrestling diamond division chip. She beat Promise Braxton, but the story here is. Thomas Braxton looks like she is reality of wrestling championship material. And I have to wonder if we will see her and Roxy again very soon for that very title. Maybe at swing vote. We will find out. I hope you enjoyed this edition of the reality of wrestling. For our executive producers, Booker T and Charvel Huffman. For our director, Kevin Bernard. My name is Brad Gilmore. And we will see you next week on The Road.